All right, guys. So this may or may not be the last and final part of this game. It all depends on how much I can last, if you will. It takes a lot for me to say that a, that a horror game is, is great. And I have to say, as scary as this game has been, I somewhat... I'm actually enjoying it. I don't know. I'm really intrigued. I'm very captivated by the story. I want to know what happens to this character, Luca. Are we going to be able to with, withstand the demonic entity with inside this home? I don't think so. I kind of briefly talked about it on the last episode. I definitely don't think so. It's pretty aggressive, and uh, I just want to continue playing. So wish me luck. Sit back. Relax. And as always, my name is Hollow, and welcome back! To a Madison game play 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 so last time we left off at the basement last time was like 15 minutes ago because I just played the second part and I'm here continuing okay but uh, we left off here at the uh, basement which gave us a crowbar now I think the crowbar is gonna be used for not only some of the planks that we've seen around the house that we thought was going to be opened or were to be opened with a shovel but it looks like it's going to be with the with the crowbar and then we also have that really crazy metallic lock within the toilet of the bathroom which i don't know what it's all about but uh yeah um interesting interesting days are ahead so the crowbar is in the basement let's get out of here i do expect her to be here that um woman she doesn't show in the photos. Somehow, the photos of her... that they burned. Okay. Here we go. Last time she showed here... Addison, we are no longer scared of you. And I hate how that statue just pops up there. And then it doesn't. Okay, the first things first. I'm gonna. I, that's what I gotta interact with. But uh, I really want to come here to my grandparents' room. Not, not that I should be here at all, but maybe we can finally open this up. That's her That's her skull, which, you know, maybe me being Luca, I would, I'd probably throw that away, you know? Just saying. Maybe that's what's haunting this home. I would throw it away or break it in half or flush it down the toilet. Even though I don't think that's possible. Is this the ring she mentioned in her diary? Elizabeth and Albert Maxwell. Ooh. God. My, my eyes. My eyes burn. God. God. I, I need to get out of this fucking house. Okay, here we go. Um, what is that? What is that? Is that like an eye? Maybe he's drawing his eyes burning? If you guys remember, um, our grandmother also had like issues with her eyes and stuff, so. This might also I be... I don't remember drawing any of these. Am I... going insane? Interesting. Also, our father has been talking to a priest, and the priest is telling him that we might be a, a victim of Madison's possession. She's trying to take over our body. To 
go from one world or one dimension into the next, I should say. All right, we're about to open this up here. Hold on. What do we have here? Oh, fuck. This is not going to be good. Okay. It says do not open. No? use okay so it's not with the crowbar well that's silly I thought I was gonna be with the crowbar Ooh. that TV just turned on didn't it getting worse now there's another piece of plank up top in the attic which we which i clearly remember so i'm gonna go here and it's gotta be this with the crowbar right what else do we have here if you find this do not listen. <laughs> oh. I'm carrying. Everything is fine. Oh, gosh. Should I play this crap? Where? Wait, what? Where's... The, oh, it's here. Oh, my God. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, I end up losing my mind. Body exchange ritual. I I need to put an end to this. The object, which is the ring, seven sacrifices the limbs. Two bodies, a guest and a ghost, or a host. Excuse me. 
Human ashes. This is some bullshit. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, dude, this this freaking biatch is about to. She's about to exchange bodies with me. She thinks this. She thinks this is funny. <laughs> uh, wait, should I put the the? I'm sorry. Should I put the ring there? There's a key. Hold on, let me see if I can put the key. Oh, I'm not not the key. The ring. Why am I doing this? No, no, this is not it, Chief. Oh, God. Um, what else? The skull. Oh, God. Fuck. Oh, God. I'm gonna lose an arm or something. It's happening. Oh, shit. I still don't know the key. I don't know why. I... Let me see what happens. Oh, oh, they're bleeding. Okay. Fuck. Not cool. Just saying. That's the the big uh, the big the big the big door that we've been kind of anticipating all this time oh my god dad are you in there dad fuck what is this oh it's getting real right now oh god okay hold on it's fine this is from grandma's diary i wonder if she kept it locked up so june 15th 1972 a haywin albert spends the night working once it gets dark, it's like the world turns upside down. There are creaking noises all over the house, and the house I know my sight is, uh, and the house. I know my sight is getting worse, but yesterday I got lost in my own home, and it's not because of my sight, but uh, the rooms are moving around. I couldn't even find my own bedroom. We are not safe here. Not anymore. Not with this thing living among us. June 16th. Aubrey got mad at me for lighting candles all over the house, but for some reason, I think light protects us. With that in mind. Okay. Bolt cutter. There must be something useful here. The bolt cutters, dude. That's for the kitchen, right? It's gotta be for the kitchen. And a saw. You better not tell me I'm gonna chop off my limb with that. I'm not doing it. It's not happening. You understand? That's not happening. that's for what if there's a piece of limb in the uh, in the toilet if there's a piece of limb on the toilet maybe I got to retrieve it and bring it here and cut it or something I don't know I feel like I should should I close that door maybe I should close that door quiet right now too quiet for comfort hmm fuck okay hold on oh, 
This is horrible. All right, so maybe now we can cut this up. Let's see what what's here. Okay, it's locked. Got the bolt cutters. Good. Another ah. I wonder what the collectibles do. Like if we collect all of them. Okay, so I'm, I'm, I'm assuming I'm going to go ahead and say that that's not the only thing the bolt cutters are for. There's no way we just unlock some bolt cutters for some fucking collectible. Impossible. Yep, it's got to be this. Oh my, do not use. Why do I have to use it? Clearly, that's what my grandmother put there. That's probably a piece of limb. I'm telling you, I'm calling it right now. But obviously, the things we're doing are not us. It's probably her controlling us. Oh, what the? Uh. How many times do I have to tell you there's nobody in this house? Al I'm done with your bullshit. Albert, listen to me. It's just a book. A fucking book, Elizabeth. See? There's no one here. It doesn't exist. I, it's not real, goddammit. I know. Everything that's happening to me has something to do with it. I just know it. It's a disease, Elizabeth. You are sick, for the Lord's sake. I'm not sick. You'll end up losing your mind if you don't cut the crap. That book has nothing to do with your illness. So if you stop asking the child, stop hiding our stuff and take your goddamn pills. Jesus! <laughs> Do you think it's normal? Do you think pupils vanish like dust? I'm telling you that that, that fucking thing is what's causing Enough, this for me. Enough, Elizabeth. Stop acting like a ten-year-old and go to bed. Albert, everything started the day we brought that fucking book to this house. It's a disease, Elizabeth. If you don't sick. believe me, I will leave this place. I'm done. And I'm taking Johnny with me. We are not staying hey, hey, here. Hey, wait a minute. This is... Oh, this is way too much. You're paranoid. Now leave it. It's 4 a.m., Elizabeth. Just, just go back to bed before we wake up Johnny. Come on. We can talk about this. You're gonna regret this. <laughs> You'll end up all alone. Just you on your stupid fucking clock. Admit I am shitting myself. Quite literally, if diarrhea was like a thing, I'm it. That's me. <laughs> diarrhea here. Just playing a video. <laughs> Just playing a video game. <laughs> okay, so if you guys remember these two things, one of them, I remember specifically, one of them had the body parts, which is the pictures. So technically, we're not gonna be cutting any limbs, so that's good. And this one was unopenable. It was like rusted or whatever. So I'm thinking maybe since the blade is not used for the block, maybe something softer. It's got to be this. So, and then that'll be part of the sacrifice. That should complete the sacrifice. Yep. Yes. Yes. Oh, crap. There it is. Nice. I'll take that. To work these must be Madison's victims oh that's disgusting all right so the other one's opened so we don't need to open up the other one it's only one of them right oh wow okay 
Madison, I'm bringing you exactly what you want. I love how she's just using us. It's quite hilarious. Oh, fuck. There it goes. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, fuck. Bloody yes. Come on, I dare you. I double, triple dare you. digits to open this door. They must be somewhere. Yes! Why, these numbers are everywhere. I don't know if I saw those numbers prior to. What the fuck's going on here? Huh? Oh! That was not there before. I'm sorry. Either that or I'm crazy. I must stress to you how dangerous these demons really are. I've witnessed a few exorcisms in my time. Not everyone lived to tell the tale. These beings are not alive, and that makes them stronger than us. They entertain themselves with us. They enjoy our fear, causing us pain. They feed off of it. It gives them power, it gives them strength. When one of them becomes attached to one of us, it's all but impossible to stop. They play with our bodies and minds Does this mean that until they find what they were that looking that woman for. Is attached to They're the no camera? longer human. Attached they are to me? Beyond everything we know. John, I implore She's you. She's no longer human. Seek help. I'll investigate that woman you told me about. Um Madison Hale. And I'll get back to you as soon as I find something. Bullshit, Keep all dude. of this information away from your son. Get rid of that camera as soon as you get this message, but please, please do be careful. If your child has already had contact with this entity, his life, yours, and your family's are Mom. in jeopardy. Chanel, what have I done? This. I need to find a way to end this. Fuck. <laughs> Uh, it burns. Uh, Not again. My body burns. Uh, hor horns? What? Uh, what? Horns? Where? I think I've seen something like this in the house. Back and grab uh... <laughs> oh my God. this is bullshit I'm going back I'm going back and grabbing my job oh, shit grabbing my shovel and my handy dandy hammer oh dear god all right so let me store um see if there's anything I can store for now nothing Oh boy, oh boy. <laughs> Fuck, I don't know. Where are those horns? I don't know. Have I seen those horns before? Have we? I don't think we have. Oh my god! <laughs> Madison, don't do that now. Come on, girl. What are you doing? Don't fuck up. I thought she was being nice and putting that chair there so I can reach something up top, but apparently, apparently that's not the case. Those horns, where are those horns? I don't know. Where have we seen those horns? Oh, fuck, dude, she's here. What a slut. Oh, no. Oh, God. No, oh, God. Oh, God, she's fucking shit up right now. Listen, if you're gonna do something, do it. If 
you're gonna do something, do it. Ah, the horns. Oh, baby, baby. Let's go. Bring it on, Maddie. <laughs> Bring it on. Zero. Is that a zero? No, no, no. No. Not, not again. No. Fuck. I, I can't feel my fingers. What is happening to my body? Uh, I, I don't know what this could mean. There was a red light, but everything was dark. Alright, so I'm gonna actually head over to... Down here, maybe? hell am I doing? Oh, I turned off the lights again. <sighs> I'm telling you, this is her, man. Like, this is her doing this shit. Nobody else. The, the doorbell. I, I gotta get to the front door. Where's the front door again? Is that? <gasps> Fuck. Oh my god, this is bullshit. real bad oh god madison don't do this you don't want to do this trust me you don't want to go there girlfriend <laughs> she's playing with my mind there is no fucking escape numbers on this one bro I swear to God
I, I thought the only floor I could go to was floor number five. Okay, back to floor one. I missed that again. This bro. I 
can break the wall with something. Madison hit his head with a sharp object repeatedly. The young man died instantly. His oh body boy. was dismembered as well. We gotta make sure this victim is 27. The victim was a 27 year old man. Madison hit his head with a sharp object repeatedly. The young man died instantly. His body was dismembered as well. That's the one right there. The third victim was a 27 year old man. Alright, good. Madison hit his head with a sharp object repeatedly. The young man died instantly. His body this bitch was is crazy, dude. As well. The third I get victim it. was a 27 year old man. The final victim was a 35 year old woman. Madison stabbed her at her own front door. Neighbors witnessed her dragging the body into the house and notified the police. The woman's body was found unrecognizable in more than 13 pieces. Jesus! The final victim was a 35 year old woman. Madison stabbed her at her own front door. Neighbors witnessed her dragging the body into the house and notified the police. The woman's body was found okay, so unrecognizable in more than 13 pieces. It was a woman, so. Yeah. 
might just be the key we needed for the uh, for the next room we've got to go into. not healthy at all that was not fucking healthy inside this room and continue on with this story so we can end this once and for all i don't know if i'll be able to make this thing this ending in this full video this is this is God. too much i need a break my body my hands this is what the priest was talking about that thing is mm. thing is feeding off of me what the fuck does this even Big mean? Talk. The house is full of clocks. Big talk. Oh shit. Hold on. Well that's nice. Alright. So three twelve. I think it was eight, right? The other one is in the bathroom. So this is left, right. I'm assuming three, twelve, and then eight to the right again. Grandpa used to work in here. Yeah, they all relatively have the same, uh, same time. Um. Okay. Did I take a picture of that? Hold on. Let me 
gotta take a picture of something here. No? This is weird, dude. So we've got the combination, the possible combination to the safe. 3128, 3128. Let's see. Let's see what this does. Okay, we're gonna go back to grandpa's room. Or his office, excuse me. That was his other room. We're going to his office now. That shit is creepy. It looks like a person there. So one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right. All right. So John, my son, I'm an old man already and life has passed to all of us. I'm so proud to see the man you've become. So happy to have deeply enjoyed two grandchildren that you've gave me, Luca and Chanel. I write this letter so that one day you can understand everything that's going on through my mind right now and debunk my myth that I'm a crazy old man. God does exist. And just like him, does Satan. All my life I tried not to believe, but time has shown me I was profoundly mistaken. Your mother was not sick at all, and I couldn't prevent her sad ending from happening. As far-fetched as it sounds, Blue Knees is real. Not a single specialist was able to trace down the cause of her condition, not to mention find a treatment to help her fight. I truly wish I could go back in time and, and tell her I believe you. Oh, so sad. I kept trying to contact her for over 15 years. I just wanted to speak with her just one last time. Soon we'll meet again and I beg her to forgive me. And I'll beg her to forgive me. This loneliness reminds me that one, that the day after, this loneliness reminds me the day after, reminds me day after day how hard it is to live without my most precious and beloved person in the world. At least I can see her face in every room of this huge house. Things are starting to connect and make sense. Regarding the book, I tried to burn it, tear it, bury it. There's no use bothering. It somehow manages to get back. Anyway, I now keep it in my possession under locks and keys. I will not allow history to repeat itself. That, uh, thank you for being the son that I've always dreamt to have. Love your dad, Humber Maxwell. Okay. Five ten. That's interesting. Five five ten. I'll start. Oh, oh that was bad. That was really bad. What is... thought I was gonna be able to finish this today but I don't know I might have to record later on and just pile it together or, or not or just make it a separate I don't know it's just it's just it's just intense all right so this all these clocks say the same thing 1255 says 820 ah this one goes here or here okay, those are all 820. Okay. good 
What does this one say? 130. 130. So I need... I need clocks to say... 640. And 1255. 640 and 1255. Or 1155, I'm sorry. Yeah. 1155 and 640. 1155 and 640. Okay. I don't I, I don't remember where these clocks are at. Right, I think there was another one up here. 1155 and 6 640. 1155 and 640. This is ridiculous, dude. Thankfully, I mean the house is big, but it's not like ginormous. your clock maybe mm -hmm. maybe 11 oh, this might be this one actually 1155 there it is come at me I dare you I know you're coming cuz I'm getting close I'm getting real close so I know you're about to jump up predictable as hell Here it is. 11.55. Yes. Last one. 5.10. Alright, last one. Gotta go all the way back. So here we, here we go. Hold on to your buttholes. It's about to get naughty. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Does it make a difference? If I close my eyes, then I can't play. And I don't know where I'm going. I hate you, man. Oh, God. The couch is upside down. That's awesome. Leave it to me to leave one of the most important clocks here, right? That's 510. I remember clearly. I remember it very clear. That is 510. Okay. Everything is under control. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm pretty nervous. She might pop out again. But I got the flashlight. The flashlight doesn't do shit. Or the flash from the camera. It just kind of makes me think it does something. But it really doesn't. Alright. Five ten, right? Five ten was over here. Yes. Oh boy. Here we go. What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? Why, 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 why? What do we got? Number two. It seems like he never finished this one. What 
does this go? All right, guys. Tell you what. I honestly, I, look, dude, my armpits. I, you probably won't see it. I have a black. You can't see it. My armpits. My pits are sweating, man. I need a break. I, I just. I'll, I'll be back to recording this. I'm gonna finish this game back to back to back. So if this is not the ending, the next one will come out. I need to take a bre uh, a breather. <laughs> this game is driving me insane. But uh, hopefully you guys are enjoying it. Of course, if you are, drop it a like. It does help out, and it lets me know that lets me know that I can't even talk. You guys want to see more. Anyways, thank you again, and uh, hopefully I will catch you on the last and final.